Hey there everybody, it's been a really long time since my last tutorial, about a month and a half, and I, I'd like to apologize for that. Um, but then on the second hand, let's get started with this one. Today I'm going to show you a program that is free, that will convert any file to any file. It's uh, called iSquint, it's like iSquint, iSquint, and uh, you can google it, I'm going to get the web address and put it in the description, and it's called iSquint. I'm going to show you the best settings for it. You know, hit Optimize for TV if you want to add it to iTunes, it will. Always check H.264 encoding and put it to Go Nuts. Advanced. Um, and you're just too cool for the defaults anyway, right? So hit OK and you can uh, do other settings if you'd like. But honestly, just keep it as is and uh, you're good. So really the only thing we did was hit optimize and H.264 encoding, hit go nuts. Then you're going to drag the file you'd like to convert in. I've got the book of Eli. Alright, we've got the book of Eli, this version, .avi, and it will, sorry, it's not any file to any file, it puts it to MPEG4. Um, so you drag in the AVI version, whoop, like that and simply hit start and it will make the MPEG-4 version right here and also put it into iTunes and that's all you need to do so that is the fastest way you can convert anything and if you're a pirater and really smart with product keys and you know what you're doing go ahead and download Visual Hub it is the next up version from iSquint it's made by the same company the only reason I'm not telling you to go and buy it is if you go to the website um, I search for is you well, hub my fingers are cold. It's really cold out. If you go to Visual Hub, it says, hey, our website's down now. After much soul searching, it's not you, it's me. For personal reasons, tech, this name has been closed, has closed its virtual doors. And uh, Visual Hub is way more advanced. I should probably show you the features of it. Visual Hub here. Here we go. You can convert to iTunes, PSP, DV, DVD, AVI, MPEG-4, MWM. WMV and MPEG or Flash. And you can tell all of them to go nuts and you've got seriously advanced features here, like it's it's professional and you can tell it when done, shut down the computer, quit Visual Hub, set computer to sleep, open full of desk. You can tell it to do a whole bunch of things. You can also stitch multiple files together, so that's really nice if you have files cut up, you can put them together. Um, optimize for any of these devices. I just have it set to all devices, 8.264, at iTunes, go nuts, and that's what I use it for. It's also faster than iSquint, but still, iSquint is awesome. So I recommend you go and download that. Like this video if you like this video, or if you went and download it, still like it. Thanks.